what's going on everybody welcome once again to nline tv i'm your host nelson aravalo jr and i'm super excited to be giving you guys a super exclusive uh, amazing shoe unboxing and review and even a I'm gonna even give you for the first time, guys, a fit. I'm gonna give you guys a fit. Uh, you guys are gonna see a video, uh, a reel, or whatever it is, a fit of me, guys. Today, guys, I have the Saucony Grid Azura 2000. Uh, Saucony? Saucony. I think people pronounce it Saucony, because it's Saucony. Saucony? I'm not sure how it's pronounced, but I'm super excited. I mean, but before we begin, this video is sponsored by Enlime. Enlime, the greatest brand out there. Check me out on Instagram at EnlimeNYC. And if you want to cop some merch, go to my website, EnlimeNYC.com. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it. If you're new here, please press that subscribe button. Help me get to 300 subscribers. Like, you know, I can't do this by myself. I need you guys to spread the word. I know you guys are watching. Faithful and loyal. Shout out to everybody that always watches my videos, always watching my contents. I, yeah, I'm blessed. Like, thank you, guys. Without further ado, I'm talking too much because I'm super excited. That's why I'm talking too much. And also, if you guys can't tell, I'm like super like, like awake. Because, you know, most of my videos I do at night because it is hard for me because I take care of my girls. I'm a full-time dad. I take care of my girls at the day. And you know, once my wife comes home, I work in the nighttime, but you know, I'm super drained by the time, like she's already home and I have to work. And you know, I have to work on my, on my clothing brand. I have to work on my resale business. I have to work on my client business, you know. Anyways, I can keep going on and on. I'm just a super busy person. Never have time for anything, and that's why I, ha I have to do my videos like at like midnight, one, three, two in the morning. It's crazy. But today, guys, it is daytime outside. I can see the. I'm super excited too because I went to see uh, wrestling yesterday, and it was dope. Uh, anyways, guys, let me get to the box. I'm talking too much. Uh, J Tips, guys. J Tips. This is the collaboration with J Tips. I saw. I completely forgot to mention that in the beginning. This is the collaboration with J Tips. It says J Tips first shoe, first shoe in collaboration with Saucony Originals. So we have on top that blue, and then the green text, and then the purple text on the bottom. Uh, I guess nice and simple. And then we have I remember who fronted. I remember who did not see the vision. I remember who changed the conversation. Saucony and Savior. So the guy Savior is. Uh, J Tips clothing brand. For those of you that are not familiar with J Tips, he is an artist, uh, you know, entrepreneur. Um, you know, you name it, he's done it. He, you know, he does rap. He's very known for his collaborations with uh, Hat Club. You know, the New Era hats. You know, that's how he started. Then with the pins, um, very known to use the flower logo with his work. Um, yeah, great, uh, great guy from New York, from the Bronx. You know, shout out to him. You know, if you're seeing this, Jay, you killed this shoe, bro. You killed this shoe, Jay Tips. Um, yo, man, I hope I get to meet you one day. You know, we do a collab. You know, Enlime Savior. You know, the Bronx and Queens. Let's go, baby. On the other side, we have like his logo right there. Then we have that normal shoe, that die cut shoe hole. You know, which is easier for people to grab the box. Grid of Zero Two Thousand, multi color. All right, guys. Oh, never in the front. Never stop believing because dreams come true. And that's right. Take a picture in these. And I and I will, Jay. And I will take a picture in these, Jay. And let's go. I, this probably is the longest I've taken to, like, review a shoe. But you know what? I don't care because there's just so much detail. And I'm going to take my time. I'm going to take my time because there's just so much detail. And we're going to get into this, guys. We're going to get crazy. We're going to get jumpy. Like, boom! Shakalaka! Let's go! Guys, like, do I look good or what next to this? Or what? You know, I got the Medellin hat, Comuna 13. Got this in Colombia. Got the pink vest, the black shirt, the Anlime shirt. I think I'm looking good, baby. Like, okay. 
for those of you not familiar with Saucony is a uh, American brand you know uh, headquarters in Pennsylvania and um, this silhouette in particular I really do like because I actually got this silhouette last year you know people might be thinking oh you just got a Saucony now because you you a hype beast and stuff like that now I like this shoe like way before then and I you know, I'm, I'm assuming that Jay also likes the silhouette too, and that's why he chose it to be his first shoe. Like, it's such a cool shoe. Like, I mean, these are a little busted because, you know, I wear these a lot. They're just super comfortable. These are size 11, but they were a little big. Um, got those from Puerto Rico, actually. So, shout out to La Familia in Puerto Rico. So, shout out to them. Um, I got these at the Sagony website. I was super late, like I realized, uh, you know, I'm not really super into like Jay Tips, uh, but I'm familiar with his work. Uh, you know, if I was into fittings, maybe I would uh, be more familiar, but like now that he dropped the shoe, you know, I'm super hyped. Like there's just so much detail. So let's start with the bottom. The bottom, it is like a translucent, kind of like a bubble gum. It's like a bubble gum bottle. Cause you know, we're familiar with the gum bottoms, but this is like a bubble gum bottom. So that's that's really cool. In the center, we have that baby blue, and then we can see the bubble action in there, transparent, the technology in there, uh, the grid technology, and the bottom is pink. And this is like, a, again, like I said, like a bubble gum, but it has like a tint of yellow. Then if we work up our way to the midsole, it is a nice pink color with that grid technology. And then we have the triangles that they look like sharks to me, you know, that that pattern. And he used, you know, in the back, uh, that baby blue. And then in the front, my favorite color. I and honestly, this is probably why I bought this shoe because of this color right here, this purple. I just love purple, guys. I just love purple. You know, I might have to put purple laces in these. We'll see, but I don't know yet. I'm really feeling the gray laces just because the shoe is super busy. And I think it, it makes the shoe like pop more with the subtle laces. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna keep the gray laces. Uh, then we have that logo with like that ponytail material. You know, he's like probably paying homage to like the Atmos, um, the Atmos uh, Nikes and stuff using like that foam material foam material and then we see the logo embroidered in like that copper color under underneath the layer we see that mesh layer and it's really cool because compared to like the OG um the OG he used like this like kind of like honeycomb texture that we see going off to the back here in the pink it's kind of like this honeycomb hexagon texture which is not on that original shoe. In the back, really cool, that checkerboard pin uh, uh, um, homage to the rapper Nipsey Hussle. And then, guys, the most powerful thing about this shoe, honestly, is this floral print. Like, you see this floral print, just go through the back, to the front. This floral print is just so significant because I get it, I mean, and he says it all the time, you know, I've seen interviews, you know, he's from the Bronx, you know, and we all have our bad days. You, we, Anybody from the city, anybody from New York, anybody from any city, anything that's like fast paced, you already know the vibes. Like we like, we're like moving very quick and it's hard, it's hard. And um, it's basically showing that, you know, we live in like the concrete jungle, but you know, like the rose, the you know, the rose is symbolizing Jay, the flower, he could grow from that. It's hard for a flower to grow in the concrete jungle because you know it's concrete. It's no like soil or dirt, and that's what he's symbolizing here. That like he's been through a lot to get here. You know he's been through a lot to get here, and you know shout out to him. He did actually release a shoe, but it wasn't like an official shoe. It was like a bespoke program with Nike, and the colors are kind of reminiscent. Probably doing another homage. To like that or that original shoe the inner nylon is that beautiful green color and then the inside is on the back too it says made by j tips uh inside we got uptown bronze uh 2007 
So I heard him in an interview saying that he was a senior in 2008. So I think me and Jay Tiz, we might be the same age. Um, not sure what 2007 stands for. Maybe that's when he came up to the idea that he wanted to be in shoes, that he wanted to be in the industry, that he wanted to be in the culture. And, you know, guys, um, sorry I haven't really been looking at the camera. I've just been really looking at the shoe because I'm just, like, super excited about the shoe. And, uh, yeah, I'm trying to see if I missed anything. On the tongue, we have that uh, Savior, his Savior logo, which is his clothing brand, an original under. Worldwide, original, yeah. Oh, so on this side we have Sakani, and this side we have Savior. And what else? We have that coral also in the front, and that coral pink in the back. Oh, it's just so many materials. And of course, the final detail for me, probably, and for him, the most important detail is remember who fronted. And I can relate, Jay. I can relate. You know, I have a clothing brand. And I can relate. I know who's fronting, man. I know who's fronting on me. People are not believing in me, but it's okay because I'm here and I'm still going. And I love this baby. The shoes also come, as I mentioned, with purple laces, but I'm gonna keep those gray laces. I'm just gonna throw these on the feet and show you guys how they look on foot. You guys, let me know. Um, thank you guys for stopping by. I really appreciate the support. Um, if you want to follow me on Instagram at LMNYC, I would really appreciate it with a follow. And if you want to cop some merch, go to my website, LMNYC.com. Thank you guys so much for stopping by. Until the next one, adios. Deuces.